it's time for my September Stitch Fix. So if you want to see what I got in this box, keep on watching. <music> Fashion friends, welcome to my channel, Dress Like You Mean It. My name is Andrea and I like to do clothing unboxings and shopping hauls, try-ons, that type of thing. If you like that kind of content, then I do hope that you will hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, uh, leave me a comment, give me a like, do all the things that um, help, help my channel grow. And I really do appreciate that you're watching my video today. So. Um, this is my first September Stitch Fix. I'll probably only get the one this month. Um, I, I have been putting out videos every week, but I actually haven't filmed a video in several weeks because I had company for, um, they were here two and a half weeks, my friends Dave and Tessa from the UK. They came to visit us, um, spent some time with some other friends, so we got a little bit of a break in there, but we did traveling, went to Moab, went to Santa Fe, uh, lots of eating and drinking, um, and they just went home yesterday. So this box, today is Tuesday, this box actually came on Sunday, and I just, I didn't have any time to, to film um, before they left. So uh, that's what I'm doing today. I've also got a Wantable box that came yesterday, and I thought about doing a side-by-side a -side comparison. I know some unboxers have done that, but the reality is I just, I in order to create consistent content, I can't do that. I have to just do one box at a time. So Stitch Fix is a styling service. They uh, have a $20 styling fee. I have the Style Pass, which is unlimited fixes for a year. I have heard and read that that is going to be no longer. Um, they just renewed me, so I, I'm assuming I will have it for the year, but they're not gonna be offering that anymore. So I'm not gonna tell you to get it if they offer it, because they're probably not gonna offer it. They send you a mailer to mail back what you don't want. I have my post office come pick it up. They send you your Oh Hello card and the price list, which I wait until the end. They send you five items, give you three days to try it on. Since I was delayed, you know, uh, delayed getting to it, I did extend my, my deadline to get it back. And I already, I kind of know what's in here because I went in there to extend it. And now you can see your stylus note, um, which is, what this is. It also has style cards to give you ideas how to style the pieces. Um, and when I went in there to extend my deadline, um, I did see, so I kind of have an idea. They also send you a preview a couple weeks before you get your box, giving you 10 items, and you can choose up to five. Um, and if you don't choose five, then they will fill in whatever it takes to make it five. So I do know that I've got some jewelry, because I saw that when I was looking. And they make this very neat little bundle. All right, taking the paper off. So this is kind of a neutral looking bundle. There actually is some color. Um, I think, I'm pretty sure I chose uh, two things for my preview. So let's do the, let's do the jewelry first. I don't get a whole lot of jewelry, um, but I, I do like it when I do get something that I can consider keeping, and I have kept a couple things over the years that I've been getting Stitch Fix. And this is a really pretty gold and silver bracelet, and I am the kind of girl that mixes her metals. It is made by 41 Hawthorne, and it's stretchy, and I kind of like that. I have been having, um, it's a little bit big, but not too big. So, I like that. And it's got kind of a, I don't know if you can see, a hammered uh, appearance or look to the metal. So that's pretty. Um, I have a lot of bracelets. I, I wear bracelets almost every day. And I found that hard bracelets tend to give me bruises. Um, as I've gotten older, I've just started bruising really easy. 
Okay, so next up is a top. I'm pretty sure I chose this from my preview. It's by Paper Moon, and it is the Reese Mixed Material Foil Print Blouse. This is in navy, and it's got these kind of a rose gold, different kinds of patterns, I guess, dots. And it's got just, I don't know if they'll be cap sleeves. I think they're gonna be cap sleeves and split neck. So I like that. The back is just the plain. I know some people don't like that and that doesn't bother me too much. So I thought that was pretty. So I wanted to try that on. It did suddenly become fall here in Colorado. When we went to Santa Fe last week on Wednesday, it was still pretty hot. It was hot down in Santa Fe. And then Sunday when we came back, it had cooled off in Santa Fe and it had definitely cooled off in Colorado. And um, it's like fall went, I'm here. <laughs> All right, next up we have by Fortune and Ivy, the Amalia Long Sleeve Knit Top. And this is really soft. It feels like that brush knit. It's in this beautiful, one of my favorite uh, colors, this teal. It's got a, a little, little ribbing at the bottom. It's got kind of a rounded hem. It is kind of sheer. I can see the ring light through it. It's got just a, it looks like maybe almost a boat neck. And I think it's gonna be full length sleeves. There's a little bit of ruching there on the sleeve. It's really soft. It's that brush knit. <clears throat> um, so I haven't, I haven't found that it pills too badly, but maybe it's because I just have so many clothes that they don't get washed that often. <laughs> All right, next up we have really pretty. Wow. This is by Violets and Roses and it is the case v-neck sweater in off-white and it's a cable knit and then the sleeves are the cable the back is not and it's a like a, a really soft knit and i had been looking for a cable knit sweater i wonder what this is made of um i think i i got one a couple years ago it's uh 60 cotton 23 percent nylon 15% acrylic and 2% spandex. So I'm excited to try that on. And then we've got Democracy, uh, Natalie Absolution Straight Leg Jean in Black. And I told her I do not need any blue jeans. I counted today. Y'all, I have almost 20 pairs of blue jeans. Um, yeah, that's almost embarrassing. Yeah, that is embarrassing. So it's just a straight leg. I have several pairs of uh, black skinny jeans and I've been looking for a pair of boyfriend jeans in black, but I think a pair of straight legs would be okay. I am slowly coming around to that look. All right, so I am actually really happy with everything I got. Let's read my note. Marcia is my stylist. She watches my videos and she does a fabulous job. Hi, Andrea, I hope you are ready for some fall weather. Yeah, it's here. It does look like you are still having warm days in Colorado, so that must have been last week. So the Reese blouse from Paper Moon that you chose from the preview will get you through the transition time. Try it with some blue jeans. I have not been able to find true boyfriend jeans, but try the pair from Democracy and see what you think. They will look great with the off-white sweater that I added for you to try. I know you will love the V-neck style. I also noticed that you had ha you had the hammered bracelet from 41 Hawthorne saved in your freestyle shop. So I added that to wear with all the tops, including the navy knit top that you chose to try. I hope that these pieces work well for you for now through fall. So let me know what you think. Enjoy, Marsha. So you can go into their freestyle, which is where you can just buy things and I think they give you like 30 days to decide if you want to keep it. Um, and you can save things. And now they have recently, the stylists have been able to go in and see what you saved and they will often put them in your fixes. So that's really nice. I also got a freestyle dress that 
I just put it in the hamper because I took it with me on vacation, but I'm gonna, um, I think I'll try that on for you as well because that's really cute. I like it. I saw somebody else try it on on another unboxing and I was like, gotta have that and I really like it a lot. So I'll show you that today too. I will show you my outfit of the day and I think everything I'm wearing is from Stitch Fix except for my shoes and then we'll do the try on. All right, let's go. Today I am wearing Democracy. Um, I think they're a kick flare uh, jeans and just a, a pretty dark wash, not super dark, but darker wash. And then this is a top from, by Daniel Rain. And then this is a cardigan by Love Appella. And it's a little bit cool today. It's only supposed to be about 70 degrees. And then these are ballet flats by Kohan. Navy blue ballet flats. So I like this top, but I'm gonna complain about something. See how it does this? It will not stay up. It just, you can see it keeps flopping down. Um, it is a kind of a catch sleeve. It's, I've got it half tucked. Um, and then it's got the stripes in the back. I like this top a lot, but this, this does kind of bug me. So that's my outfit of the day. Let's try on some clothes. Okay, so we have the Democracy black straight leg jeans and they fit nicely. They're a, a tiny bit snug, but like I said, I just spent two and a half weeks doing all kinds of eating and drinking. And um, so my weight ticked up a little bit and things are feeling a little snugger than they normally do. Um, next week, I am going to New York City. Um, my oldest son has a supper club and we're going to eat there one night and then we're going on to Philadelphia because uh, there's a family wedding. So still going to be lots of eating and drinking in my near future and then I am really going to crack down um, and try to start exercising again. Anyway, you don't need to know all that. So these, I like the way these fit, the democracy. Um, they're a nice dark wash, a nice saturated black is what I mean to say. And what, um, that's what I like. That's, you know, I don't like faded black jeans. I always worry a little bit when I buy non-premium brand black jeans because I have found that they tend to fade after just a couple washings. And that's one of the reasons why I don't mind investing in, you know, high-end jeans, especially black, because I have, you know, Paige and, uh, seven for all mankind and I've had them for years and they are still you know just nice saturated black so that's one thing that I'll have to think about love the sweater very soft come up closer show you the sweater love the v-neck Marcia knows that and it's got the you know the cable this is exactly what I was looking for a year or two ago and, but it's, you know, a cable knit sweater is a total classic, right? So these both are contenders. Let me give you a little, little closer look of the pants. So they come to just below my belly button. So that's kind of a mid rise and the, shed, the sweater is shedding on them. So although this is a, a good look, I'm not sure, I guess it's not too bad. I'm not sure I would necessarily want to wear them together. The sweater does shed too much, but you can see they're, they're good length. They come just to the, the top of my shoes. These are pink kids that I got in my Barbie themed box. So if you haven't seen that video, go watch that after you watch this one. And then these are from the back. Yeah, so this is a good outfit. For sure, both of these are, are contenders. All right, well, let's try on something else. So we've got this top, I think it's by 41 Hawthorne. It's um, got the light cap sleeves, the split neck, uh, it's the mixed material, so it's plain in the back. Come up a little bit closer. So compared to like that Daniel Rain that I was wearing, uh, my outfit of the day. See how this just lays nice? It's not like doing anything weird. And I could certainly do 
a front tuck with this. I think that would look good. I like I like the gold sparkle, the rose gold. My husband said he liked it. I'm not sure I love the arms. The cuff there is is like the material that's on the back. Um, so I yeah, I like this a lot. I'm just trying to decide if I'm okay with how my arms look. What do you think? Does that look okay? It's a nice top, might depend on how much it costs, but again, it's another contender because I, I do like it. The other thing that is gonna play into all this is my budget, so. All right, let me know what you think about this one. And then we've got one more to try. And here we have this last top. It is that brush knit that is super soft, but that does have a tendency to pill. It has the ribbed bottom that comes up at the side. And like that in the back, it's just got this, I guess that's more of a scoop neck, not really a boat neck. I put the bracelet on with it. It's got the ruching there. So this is nice. I, I don't think, you know, I don't like it as much as like the white sweater, but it's nice. It would be, you know, it's a nice weight for fall. Yeah, this has been a really, really good box. So before we do prices and a recap though, I am gonna try on that dress that I got from Freestyle. So I'll be right back with that. So this is the dress. It's in this very pretty teal color. It is wrinkled because it was packed in my suitcase. And um, I paired it with these shoes that I got from Nordstrom Rack that are by Sam Edelman, I believe. And they're a different teal, but I think they go. They don't match, but I think they go. So it hits around mid-calf. It's a, a finely ribbed material. I'm not wearing shapewear. It's got this cutout sleeveless. I, uh, Laura from Little Box of Happy, got this in a box. And I just was like, I have to have that dress. And I just got on Freestyle and ordered it like that. So. What do you think of this? I really like it. It's really comfortable, really nice material. All right, let's do prices and a recap. So what did you think of that box? It was pretty fantastic, I think. Um, Marcia, she just has done a great job for me right from the start. Okay, so it says, thanks for lending us style fix number 73 for you, enjoy. Um, if you've been watching my channel for a, a longer period of time, then you would know that there was a fix that got lost and they, I don't think they ever changed that. So, okay, the stylist, let's go through each item uh, one by one before we do the total. So the 41 Hawthorne hammered stretch bracelet in gold and silver is 48. I really like it. Um, that's probably a little more than I would, would spend on a bracelet, but I think, I, I like that it's stretchy and I don't think it would give me bruises. So I like that. Then we've got the Democracy Natalie Absolution straight leg jeans in black. Those are 78. Those are the most expensive thing in the box. And like I said, I'm just, if you have black democracy jeans, that, that saturated black, will you leave me a comment and let me know if they hold their color well? Because that's my, that's really my only concern because I thought, <coughs> excuse me, I like the, the cut, the straight leg, and I like the way they fit. Then we've got the Paper Moon Reese Mixed Material Foil Print, and then it goes on. And that's $40. So my only hesitation right now is just that we are getting into the cooler months so i'm wondering how much i would wear it but i could probably wear it like with this cardigan or a denim jacket okay so that's i like that the fortune and ivy amalia long sleeve knit top in they're calling this navy i call that teal um, that is 42 dollars this is, I, I liked it okay. I, it was probably my least favorite, but there has to be a least favorite, right? I guess not. Um, Violets and Roses case v-neck sweater in off-white is $52. I really like this a whole, whole, whole lot. 
Okay, so the stylus pick subtotal is $260. The buy all discount, if you buy all five pieces, you do get a 25% discount, which is a really good deal. And that takes off $65. And that brings the order subtotal to $195, which I think $195 for these five items is really good. However, I did just get charged for my style pass, which is $49, and then they will deduct that from you know what you purchase next until you use that credit up, that $49 credit up. So that brings it down to $146, which makes it almost irresistible. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, I have that wantable box. And I kind of like it when I get them back to back because that way I can, you know, I can look and compare. So um, right now I'm thinking I, I really like everything. I like this the best. I really like the black jeans. That's, that's something that I don't have in my closet, black straight leg jeans. Um, so those two things are, are really the strongest contenders. Um, I like the short sleeve shirt and the, the, you know, the longer sleeve one was, was okay. And then I like the bracelet. I don't know. I'll have to crunch some numbers and then see what, see what is in my wantable box. If you haven't tried Stitch Fix, I will leave my link below. I will leave it in the description box as well as pin the first comment. And if you use that link, that will give you $25 off your first fix. And I will also get $25, which really helps support my channel. And I really appreciate it when you do use any of my links. All right, fashion friends, I got some deciding to do and some more trying on to do. So until next time, don't forget to dress like you mean it.